The Lake Nile's disaster happened in the northwest region of Cameroon on the day of August 21, 1986. It is one of the three known lakes in the world to be saturated with carbon dioxide. Even though scientists had believed the volcano is to be extinct, on the day farmers living near Lake Niles heard rumbling. A spray shot hundreds of feet from the lake with a white cloud over the water. The cloud was 328 feet tall. It had left the nearby farmers unconscious or dead in a few breaths. It had killed up to 15.5 miles from the lake, including 1,700 people, 3,500 livestock, and even insects. The survivors said dead people didn't even have flies on them. The flies were even dead. Most people were killed in their sleep. It had gotten to three villages once to be thought of as completely killed off. The once blue lake has now turned a dark rust color. The lake released up to 1.6 million tons of CO2. CO2 is denser than air, which had caused it harder for people to breathe. Although it is still a mystery on how it happened, there are theories. One is that the cool rainwater falling on one side of the lake triggered an overturn. The survivors were treated with hydrogen and sulfur gases. These symptoms were burning red pain in the eyes and nose, coughing, and signs similar to strangulation. Pipes have now been installed in Lake Niles and nearby lakes to allow CO2 at the bottom of the lakes to be able to slowly come out, preventing it to happen again.